hi guys welcome to the channel i hope you're all doing well so today i wanted to just share a little i will call it self-care but i don't know self-care too i guess self-care means a lot of different things to different people but yeah i thought of this video showing you this toothpaste this toothpaste is pure baking soda so it's 100 percent baking soda and it's from ham and hammer i just bumped into it at tesco i mean b and m the other day uh, and you know what i feel like i've seen a lot of diff i've seen a major difference in my in the color of my teeth than i've done in a while um even when i used all those you know special smile that it's a smile i don't know if it's smile direct but i know there was a brand i tried one time a teeth whitening brand that i tried one time and i i mean i said i saw a result for the first few days and after that there was nothing nothing else was happening especially on my bottom teeth nothing else was happening to that nothing was happening to that so uh and they were quite expensive but ever since using this pure baking soda i've been seeing a lot of different both at my top teeth and my bottom teeth i just thought i'd share that with you guys and then um, yeah so self-care for me um so i don't know what to call this i wasn't sure what to call this video whether self-care or doing a day of doing the things that i love so one of the major things that I love, like I shared with you earlier, was the baking sort of joke place, you know, so teeth whitening. And then food, I was showing my shopping earlier because that's one thing that I love, thing that makes me happy to know, to just know that there is food in my fridge. It doesn't have to be full to the brain, but as long as there's food and there's always something, because not having something in the fridge really does affect me i never knew that until when it happened to us there was a time in our life that we had that we had that moment and he and i and i know that of us going forward by the grace of god we will never have to experience such things again it's 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 not an experience that i really enjoyed not knowing what to eat not knowing not, not, not it's not even not knowing what to eat it's just not having anything in your fridge that you can you know to having any food oh my gosh and that's why i feel very sorry for those who probably especially at this time of the year now that is coming to christmas that people don't really have anything to celebrate with my actually goes out to them and i just pray that god will bless me and i mean even right now i'll do what i can to help out but what will bless me so much that i can give to people who are you know in that kind of state searching for something that ain't lost so yeah just food and then um also obviously i like to plan and just because i'm doing a lot of many things i have about i have two just two channels obviously you just vlog channel and my shopping channel and i also have like three um social medias that i am managing as well i'm social on instagram that i'm managing as well so of recent i've needed to just plan and I feel like it's just kept me on the narrow path <laughs> and it just made me feel like there's something going on in my life and it just put me straight really that's what I'm just trying to say and it just I love to I'm more of a I'm not a journal kind of person you would not catch me using a journal I've tried it before it's not me and I will never buy journals even when you, even if you gift it to me I won't use it I am a scribbler I just write so I don't like to be limited to things that I want to write. I mean, a lot of this journal to just give you this two, three, four lines to write. I'm like, no, that's not me. I'm a writer. I write. I do blogging as well, if you see the even know. So I just like to scribble. Although a lot of my blogging is, um, what's it called? Is electronically, but a lot of sometimes, especially when I have ideas, I just pump into my head. I just like to have something to write on straight away. But yeah. I write so I like to just have a blank page where I can just scribble and write anything I want to write as opposed to all this journal thing. I don't do them. I got a packet, a pamper care from 
a friend and I, it was just you know i felt i felt touched by it because it's not all, all the time i get i i rarely get things from people <laughs> i do you know i can count with my fingers how many times someone has gifted me anything so i really felt touched by it as well and i'm just showing you guys well this is from amazon actually <laughs> it's from amazon and uh it was really nice actually it's, it's got the rose flavor and the smell to it it's really nice i'm just showing you guys what is here and there's just so much in it actually that I, I didn't think of. You know, a lot of times you just get a shower gel, bath bomb, and something like that. Not much, but this one's got hand gel, and uh, hand wash, body lotion, some another kind of lotion. It's got quite a few things in there, which is I think is quite nice actually. Yeah, and another thing that I like to do, which I love to do, also, is decorating. I mean, you will be seeing, you've seen that if you haven't followed me so far. You, you, I mean, it's something that I do on this channel. I love to decorate. I love to change this and all things around. And that's why you see me. The Christmas is coming, and I'm excited. So, by the grace of God, I'll be doing um, vlogmas this Christmas. I oh, this is my first time ever doing it, and I hope that I can actually do it. For the old is it 24 days is it 24 or 25 days i don't know but it's usually the days late into christmas from the first of december so i think i'll probably do mine from the first of december to the 24th of december and we didn't have a plan of doing something for christmas which we've never done before but um i'm not sure yet but i need to confirm with god i felt like god was telling me not to do it um i think it was just a couple of days ago i i mean i, I heard it say I shouldn't do that thing we shouldn't do it but i need to confirm <laughs> Actually, on the day when I was out filming this, it was actually very dull and gloomy. It was raining, so I thought, you know what? Let me set the ambience as well. And another thing I like to do is also to read my devotional. I really love the UCB Word for Today devotional. Although it's a bit reversed, normally I, I, I tend to read it in the morning or maybe at night. That's when I can read it. But as you can see, it's, this is during midday. And so on to, today's topic was, um, are you doing God's will? So, and I was talking about, um, you know, just making sure that you're doing God's will and God because God has a plan for our lives and yeah it was just talking about if God um shows our entire life at the time it will can be I mean it can be very overwhelming so what we're just doing is we are just kind of like he's revealing it to us bit by bit obviously as we grow older as we get closer to it we become more mature and more able to undo all the things that are coming at us you know and um so yeah, I think that's one thing. So that's a way to look at it when it comes to God's plan for your life. It's like a scroll. You just and it just unravels it to us bit by bit, you know. And yeah, but the thing is that one thing that we just need to know be aware of is that because it's his plan for us, we need his grace, we need his power, we need his strength to be able to go through it, you know, all the ups and the downs of life, you know. 
and you know you could, the thing is that the ups is necessary is good but the downs is also necessary you know to help us to mature to grow and you know be the best that we can you know if everything was always handed over to us everything was always going smooth and uh, smooth for us we will take things for granted and yeah. yeah this is where i'm gonna leave it guys i hope you've enjoyed this video i hope it's inspired you in one way or the other I want to say thank you for watching guys and I will catch you again in the next video. Bye bye.